Let me out! Let me out! Let me out of this! Let me out of this television set! I can't! I can't stand it anymore! Hello, I'm Regis Philman, and I'm here with Kathy Lee. This is Kathy Lee, and, and today we have uh, four paraplegics who have discovered anatomy in the Toadstool collection, and as well as the botany, a botany uh, formation of certain uh, types. This is. In addition, uh, this week we are also interviewing uh, some of the finest quill entertainment that you will see in this price range. My name's Jerry Aldini, and uh, welcome to our show, and my name's Harry Truman. Uh, tonight we're going to be discussing a wonderful and classic, scholastic view of the modern uh, collegiate party. And the modern collegiate party in terms of the festive but uh, somewhat tranquil Halloween treat is All Saints Eve decoration, in which people dress up in various and numerous uh, types of uh, holiday festival uh, commodities and, and, and dress and costumes to parade around and look absolutely silly and stupid talking into a bottle of uh, Spanish olives. So in case that you're wondering uh, what's going on here, let's take a look and let's go and, and travel about and see just what's happening, see what's happening in our fine uh, fine world here. So let's let's walk, shall we? And uh, here we have a uh, wonderful husband right here. This is... Uh, this is... Uh, this is uh, Kim Kim Alexander. She's from the uh, what Kim Alexander. Um, you know, uh, you know, yeah, she's uh, she's developed a very severe facial rash, as you can see, and that has caused some severe embarrassment to her and subsequent friends after her parents got over the severe disappointment of not having a boy. That is. So let's go over here and now uh, we'll do some more things. Here. Just started studying. Like a falling lemon. So, falling lemon from hell. Not enough, but I think. Right. Wait, do you speak Spanish? Wait, wait, watch out. Wait, get over here. Wait, she has to get over here. Turn the, turn the lights out. Oh, it's got a white balance. Watch this scene. No, she went away. I'm supposed to be a man, remember? I know, but I'm Rudolph Valentino, and there were questions. But we know that she isn't. However, there were questions. the man that I was was most definitely of this nature. <laughs> uh, what's my Um, hi, my name is Brian. Um, I study at Pitt. Um, Hola, ¿cómo estás? Pues yo soy, me llamo Briano, ¿no? Y, y pues he traído algunos amigos míos, ¿no? Emily, ¿no? 
que, que se presenta con New York Times, ¿no? Y un amigo mío, Joseph, ¿no? Eh, y Harley Davidson, ¿no? This is an original costume that I made in about 20 minutes. But most people think I'm Ace Frehley. But I really don't know. Good name. Do you know? So I can't say that. How are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm fine. This is Laura Cartier. Can you believe it? I don't think you can. She's quite unlike anything she has ever been before. And not to see all. She is. What is a star this entire party? So too dark, let's go in here a little bit. Uh, we're coming in here, we're meeting Famine. Hi. Is here. She has developed somewhat of a very severe uh, physical depression from just consuming this rock. And you well, you know, what I'm saying is that what we have here is actually this fine woman here who has demonstrated severe dexterity from the waist down in a double jointed position. Uh, and she's been very wonderful about the whole you know thing, and the experiment has served very hey, successful. Hey, you're not allowed to eat because I'm Famine. And look at these. I have silverware in my She has silverware, silverware on her ears. Now, does that not give you a chub or what? I am just really excited about the whole thing myself. And, and really, I think it's quite quite an establishment in uh, silverware uh, decoration. I'm one of the four horsemen of the apocalypse, isn't it? Yeah, she's one of the four horsemen of the apocalypse. I am. No, that's not the, the coming of a horseman or any Jane Fonda film, to be exact, but we're not here to promote Vietnam uh, protagonists. No, just other than that, uh, other than that, yes, uh, other than that, I just want to say one thing before I leave. My parents came to this country as Greek immigrants and uh, taught me that this country is uh, the finest country. And uh, that I have been in public service now for over 25 years, and, and I intend to be that way. I intend to say that way. And it's not, it's not a president's concern. It's not a Republican concern or a Democratic concern. It's, it's a guy with fuzzy eyebrows concern, a parent concern. All right? Until then, take care, babe. Thank you. I want you, Allison, and I want you now. I want you. I want your red hot lips to touch mine. And I want you to know that you are a great person. And, and oh, Allison, you're hot. <laughs>